Hello and welcome back to Crip Parametric 3D Modeling Exercises for Beginners. Today, let's just try out to make this simple exercise inside Crip Parametric. I'm in Crip Parametric 7.0 environment. You can cancel it and create a new one. Assign the proper name and check this to use the proper units. First, we will make the base plane 60 by 30 and the extrusion becomes 90. Extrude, choose the top plane, make it normal. Center rectangle, like this. This becomes 60. And the width becomes 30. Hit OK. Define the extrusion 9. Press middle mouse button to confirm this. After this, I will add a corner rectangle on this face, corner rectangle like this, somewhere here, this become 18, hit OK and define the height 30 minus 9 which becomes 21, hit OK. I will add the round portion on this face, make it normal. Draw center circle like this, from here, somewhere here. Hit OK. Flip the direction and say OK. Now I will add the cutout of radius 15. Choose this face, extrude, make it normal. Take the reference of this circle, click on circle and the center is this one. Press middle mouse button and define dimension 15. Hit OK. Flip the direction, remove material and select through all. See? Next these chamfers of 9. Click on chamfer define value 9 select this edge and this edge hit ok next you can create this portion by using extrude or you can use the rib option I will use the extrude option for now to create a middle plane click on plane and select the opposite side with control key of the object Choose this, click on extrude and make it normal. This time I will add a line like this from here, somewhere here, like this, and close the sketch. Make sure to keep it symmetry, and this becomes 7. And you have done. Click on view, apply some appearance, and this time I will choose red, select part, and hit OK. You have done. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. See you in next tutorial. Thank you.